Today I'm going to work in my Art Prompts art journal. I'm following along with art prompts that are given by Deb at Art Zoology. There's a link to Deb's channel, Art Zoology, and the prompt 13, which is the prompt that I'm working on today, which happens to be favorite quote. There's a link to both of those in the description box below. Before I get started, I want to show you, uh, yes, I worked in my little faces sketchy journal again. And I want to show you where I'm at. I sketched three of them today. Actually, I dated these the 30th, but today's the 29th, but I'm going to leave it the 30th. I sketched this gentleman. Really happy with how he turned out. His eyes were half closed. He has a lot of frown marks. He had a nice formed mustache and beard. And his head was facing off this direction. So I got a good view of the ear. Nice high forehead. Really enjoyed this sketch. And then I sketched this gentleman who had a nice frown on his face. I'm getting those frown marks on both of these. these. He's not so much frowning, I think, as if that's just from an aging man. The, the eyebrows have extra skin in there. Here, he was frowning. <laughs> so, yeah, I enjoyed sketching him. I'm very happy with the results. And then I sketched this young man. And this is not a boy. This is a young man, probably in his early 20s, I would say. So those are the three that I did today. So today I'm going to work on my favorite quote. Now, because my favorite quote, if you watched my recent chat video, which was a TMI, too much information tag, they ask you what your favorite quote was. And I said John 3.16. And I'm going to keep that, but since this is a faith-based page that I'm going to do, I am going to put the comments on approval basis and mute the thumbs up and thumbs down. You can still leave me comments, and I will see them. And as I get out to my YouTube area, I will approve them. So far, I have not had any really bad comments and on my faith-based pages and I really appreciate that. So I'm going to start a new page. I'm going to work in the stained glass mode and I'm going to work with writing. I don't think I can get the entire verse on here because I'm going to write fairly big and I want my writing, if I can achieve that, to work in to the stained glass design and I'm still working out how exactly how I want to do that. I try it different ways. So I'm just going to go to it and let's see what happens. This is very wet. I have a tendency to want to work with it while it's still wet and I mess it up. I'm going to let it dry. As you can see, I wrote out the words and then as I drew in my stained glass elements, which I may put in a few more in here when it gets drier, as I drew those in, all that word fell into the design of the stained glass window. While I'm waiting for my page to dry, I think that I'm going to do a sketch, a face sketch. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, I'm going to call it quits on this. I think I probably got out of frame on a lot of this. I was just sketching this while my paint was drying on my art journal page. <laughs> I'm going to call this finished it is very wet I just put black paint on this again to bring those words out more but I do like how they're beginning to blend in with the background I'm still working with how to get words into a stained glass window that is a challenge but I do like this. I like this a lot. You can't tell it, but I do have a very thin strip of gold all the way around here. I will see you on the next page. <laughs>